Yo, this is Gabe Rosales. Quick PSA uh, information to parents. Just wanted to address a couple of things that were on my mind recently. Uh, talking about technology and stuff like that. Pay attention to what you're saying uh, around your kids. I know that we um, grew up with no technology. I mean, we know little technology. We had friggin' uh, Oregon Trail and where in the world was Carmen San Diego. <clears throat> and everything was green. But uh, when we sit there and we're on our phones and we get frustrated at how slow the internet's working or how slow our phone's working or something like that, you know, the kids watch that, they see us, and they don't know the difference. They never had what we had. They never had to deal with what we had. They don't even talk to parents. Like, we had to call up, uh, when we called our friends' houses, we had, you know, their parents might answer the phone. We might be forced to talk to their parents. So we got used to speaking to adults. That's what we had to do. That was, uh, I guess, an inconvenience for us. Kids don't have to do that these days. They just text message each other a billion different things, and then they don't even respond in real time. They don't have to think in real time. So the point being is that they didn't have the technology uh, jump that we had. They didn't see how far we've came. And the thing is, we're also paying for our technology. Um, the reason why this is so important is because when kids see us, parents or adults or whatever, anybody that's in kind of any kind of position of leadership, complaining about how our phones don't work and how this is slow and this is slow, they start thinking that <clears throat> if anything is slow or you have to wait for anything, that it's broken and it doesn't work, that they should not be inconvenienced in any way. But the world is inconveniencing. And so that's one thing that I think people need to address, parents need to address, because it's freaking ridiculous. You know, uh, anytime anything doesn't work or a kid has to put it some kind of effort into something, they think it's broken. That's wrong. It's not broken. It means you might have to put a little more effort into it. And a lot of times, like obviously like in sports and any other kind of thing, um, you have to put a lot of effort into something to get good at something. Practicing an instrument, for example. It's not going to come in two seconds, and it's not broken because you don't know how to do it. Uh, you figure out how to do it, and and then you move on. You progress. That's But that's the thing that I think parents need to take into account. They need to uh, be aware of when they're cussing out their phones or talking about how slow the internet is or whatever whatever the situation may be. Point being, uh, pay attention to what you say to your kids. It takes a town to raise a child. It's not just the parents that are doing this. It's everybody that's around kids in general. So just a heads up, something that's been on my head recently. Peace.